Well, the Buffalo Public School Superintendent just wrapped up a news conference about the shooting and stabbing at McKinley High School, and we had some tough questions for him today. Two on your side's Kelly Dudzik joins us live from the school. Kelly, what were you able to find out? Yeah, Scott and Mary Ellis, that press conference ended just about 10 minutes ago, and Dr. Kreiner Cash says that staff and teachers will have an optional in service day that's tomorrow from 9 a.m. until noon. He says students will start going back to school for in person learning on Tuesday in phases. I asked him about the security officer situation and what is going on at the school with that because he said that there are five assigned to the building. Two security officers stayed late to help out on Wednesday. I asked him if there are any school resource officers assigned to the school, police officers, and if he's planning on asking the city for help. If the school district asks for additional support, he will grant it. Uh, and what I did ask him, short answer is no, we don't have uh, SROs assigned here right now. But he, I said, Mayor Brown, could you for a few weeks, let's say to the end of March, could you provide several officers to drive by, stop out front, come in, do sort of a check around the school, talk with the admin team, say, is there anything you need help with, any assistance I can provide for the next several weeks uh, through March? And he said, yes, Doc, absolutely. Dr. Cash also apologized to parents this afternoon, saying he was sorry if they didn't find out about what was going on soon enough. Live in Buffalo, Kelly Dodzik, Channel 2 News.